M0FXB still looking at the MMDVM Chinese hat with the O star operating system and it's just showing you here how to log into it so you plug the thing in and you it sends out a Wi-Fi it says here we assume that you can set up SSH connection by connecting your PC via Wi-Fi to the open network that is generated by the board in Windows you use putty on the Mac the terminal so the login root the login username is root and the password is one two three four five six seven eight then you execute the following instruction instructions from the prompt copy these lines without enter and you will make you won't make any mistakes <laughs> so basically copy and paste so copy and paste ignore the enter uh, copy and paste you, you are selecting enter um, and then the IP address after the firmware is 192.168.10.1. AP Wi-Fi is now is now called on open WRT. I thought, but I changed it myself later. This AP is up and running if there is no internet connection. The password for the Wi-Fi is O star AP is open one two three four. Log in now with user root and no password either through your web browser. There you are, there's the web, the IP address, SSH to the same address. By the way, it's better to set, set the password with the instruction PASSWD and then enter your new password twice. Finally, if you're stuck, press and hold the WP3S to turn the Wi-Fi on or off. Hold down the WPS 10S, uh, 10 seconds to do a factory reset. So I'm guessing that's the white button on the side where everything is as it was immediately after the update. So there you are. If you get stuck, you can do a factory reset. So, and then we've got new firmware for MMDVM board. Let's click that. And we even have some instructions here. So let's open, let's have a good look at these instructions. Firmware clone update Chinese board. And it's, it's not in English. <laughs> so uh, we've got this link here, which I will select. So we can't read it now. We'll, we'll get a converter, Google converter, to convert all this. Uh, there you are. We're starting seeing some English wor words now. Like so, we go down. English version. Here is the translated simplified way to update the firmware. You still have to make the basic settings. Yeah, we've read that. We assume, yeah, this is all the bit we just read. Let's see if the links work on here, because on, on the other one, the link was dead. Uh, but yeah, same as what I've just described, actually. So I'll put a link in for that as well. And I'm pretty sure that that link is dead, but the link is for, you still have to make the basic settings via the LUCI web portal, which is standard with OpenWRT. Here is a link. So we're just gonna have to learn um, LUCI web portal. So I don't actually know how to do this, but here's a link that I found with the lots of information. So I'll put that link in as well. And fingers crossed, 7-3, thanks for watching my channel. Please subscribe or like if you find this helpful.